Should have been in the club last night, but they be jumping. I was up in that be like, Ray. Nigga, you know I don't fool these damn clubs down here in Little Rock, man. I'll rush. I don't. You broke ass hoes look like they get electric tape on their forehead and big ass eyebrows. <laughs> you kind of look like them girls on the reality TV and shit. Man, while you was at the house beating your meat, I would get choked by a bad ass chick named Peaches. Peaches? <laughs> <laughs> Nigga, she sound like a stripper with diabetes. Getting well, choked. You know your ass don't know nobody no getting choked. You probably in that trick. How many drinks you buy? To look. You don't worry about how many drinks I How many drinks you buy, nigga? You probably yeah. bought the whole team some drinks, ain't you? That was man. You did, nigga. <laughs> hey! Bro! You need to be trying to get things to this, man. Buy somebody who cuts up, bro. Man, anything. Bro, this fight been sold out for three weeks. <laughs> Tickets right now are gonna be high as a wall's booty. Man, ain't no way in the hell. Ain't no way in the hell we're gonna go no tank fight, bro. Hey, what's up, homie? You dodging me? What the fuck wrong with your phone? Oh, my phone? Man, you not in my bummer phone, man. You know what I'm saying? You be like, hello? Hello? Hey, fuck Dad that, bro. You need to get my money to me and get it to me today. Money? <laughs> nigga, nigga, who the fuck is this right. nigga? I don't worry about that, man. You know what I'm you saying? you always do with some money, bro? Man, he just, he just acting trying to front in front of everybody, man. You know what I'm saying? Front in front of everybody? Nigga, we in the fucking alley, nigga. Hey, nigga, you got my money? Hell no, nigga ain't got no money. I ain't got nothing to do with this shit, bro. Well, just shut the fuck up, or I'ma murk both of you motherfuckers out here today. Hold up, nigga, who the fuck you talking to, nigga? I'm a grown ass man, first of all, nigga. You throw down here, nigga. Hey, wait, wait. Look, look, look. Chance. I got this. Look. Fuck, dog. You know what I'm saying? I remember I told you, I ain't got your money. But D got your money. Nigga, who the fuck is D? D you know who D is. D's nuts, nigga. <laughs> Nigga, don't get what the fuck wrong with you, nigga. This man ain't motherfuck. playing with you, bro. Real funny motherfucker. Dude, man, we playing this shit. I turned to know who you walking by. Bro, that one, I should be able to do the fatty type shit. <laughs> oh, oh, bitch. I don't give a fuck. Hey, fuck this shit. Oh, oh, man. Fuck this whole motherfucking bitch. Bitch, nigga. Bitch, bitch, nigga. Yeah, can I speak to Peaches? What's up, girl? This this big Dookie. D Dookie. We was at the club, I met you at the club, and I bought you and your friends drinks. You mean everybody would buy you? I had on the red polo and the J's and the Rockerwear. What? And all my, and all my clothes ain't, wasn't fake. Now, look, look, check this out. All I was doing, I was just calling to see if you wanted to, like, you know what I'm saying, hang out. A, a, Michael, a Michael Kors purse. Oh, well, you know, it ain't nothing to a boss. All right, for sure. Bet. Oh, hey. Hey, wear something tight. Because you know I'm trying to see all that ass I seen at the club. For sure. Bet that up. All right. So, how does it feel to be hanging with a real baller? <laughs> Nigga, you ain't showing me nothing special. I mean, you ain't so funny. I am a baller. A baller? Nigga, if you gotta call yourself a baller, you ain't no baller. That shit is lame. First of all, no second of all, why the hell they call you Dookie anyway? Shit, some shit, bitch. Bitch? I mean, I don't mean like, you know what I'm saying, like, I mean like a bad bitch, good bitch. Not like a bad bitch, bad bitch, you know what I'm saying? like. I didn't, you know what I'm saying? No. I apologize, I'm just like, shit. But anyway, why you asking so many questions? <laughs> you got attitude because I'm asking you some questions. And you trying to get up in this over here? Oh, I mean, 
Since you put it that way, I mean, what you want to know? I'm open book, baby. What's happening? How you make your money anyway? Fit. Girl, shh. You got that work. I run everything from Wright Avenue to the South End. It's me. Damn. OG steps. You a boss like that? You damn right. Mmm. So you supposed to be a goon or something now, huh? So what's up with this teardrop on your face? Because I remember seeing that teardrop a month ago. What you mean by that? What I'm saying is, is I remember you having that teardrop on your face when you was in the club over a month ago when you was trying to buy me and TT them $2 ass drinks. Yeah, that was well drinks anyway. Plus, it was ladies night. You wasn't balling in. So what the fuck you trying to say? What I'm saying is, everybody know that the same nigga, a real boss, and had the South End to Wright Avenue sewn up for years. All of a sudden, this nigga come up dead. Nobody know about that shit but you. So they only tell me one thing. You the one killed Lucky. You better watch your fucking mouth or you end up like that nigga. You understand? Your ass is the walking dead. You don't put your hands on me. Hey, Chance, bro. For real. Hey, shit, bro. We gotta ride, man. This bitch fucked up, man. She got me fucked up. Doogie, what the hell you talking about, nigga? Busting all up in my shit like you ain't lost your mind. Look, man. You remember I was telling you about peaches, right? I'm riding with little mama, man. She get to asking me questions, shit, about my teardrop and shit. Next thing you know, she talking about shit. No, I killed Lucky. Hey. Bro, she talking about, you know what I'm saying, talking all crazy, she asked me how I make my money. So I slapped that bitch talking about she going to get them goons, bro. <laughs> we got to ride, man. Besides, this is your fault anyway. My fault? Man, let me tell you something. I took a bullet for your dumb ass the other day. Not only that, I put a nigga in the ground over your stupid ass shit that you got going on. Man, I'm tired of playing with this shit, you know what I'm saying? I'm tired of always having to come to your rescue, Dookie. You need to get your life together. You need to get your shit together, Dookie. I'm serious. Man, you remember Jazzy? You ought to let her pray for you. She been praying for me, you know what I'm saying? I've been finding You know God. what? Yeah, I remember Jazzy. I do. You talking about the bitch that left you? Bitch! You know what I'm saying? And you ain't had nothing but me? You belong to these streets, nigga. You, you right. You, you up here playing for a house. You got your daughter. You got, you got your girl. You know what I'm saying? And everything cool. But you got to remember one thing, nigga. You kill Lucky. Not me. See what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, I got this teardrop on my eye, nigga. But yeah, fuck love. Love is for suckers, nigga. And I don't need no prep. I got money, nigga. I'll tell you something, nigga. Say something else, goddammit. You done broke up in my shit, and you won't talk disrespectful? Nigga, I took a bullet for you. I done put a nigga in the damn dirt over you. You gonna bust up in my damn house. You gonna disrespect my daughter and my girl. Let me tell you something, nigga. You say something out of bitch, look at your mouth now. How a bitch feel when she gets slapped, nigga. That's how you look. Apologize to her. I said apologize. Sorry. Duke, I love you like a brother. And that's the only way you're still breathing right now. I love you like a brother. But I'm going to tell you like this, man. You need to get your shit together. Get your life together, man. Because I'm going to tell you one more thing. You disrespect me one more time, you ain't got to worry about them niggas in the hood taking you out. Because I'll blow your damn head out of my fucking self. I love you, bro. Get the hell out of my house. What's what the fuck you want? Listen, Daddy. I just want to apologize for what happened the other night. I'm just not used to being with a real boss nigga. Hmm. Hmm. I'm glad you come around to your senses. Yeah, a bitch gotta be put in her lane every now and again. 
So if you want to tap this ass later, I understand. How about we go to the tank versus Miller Wayne tonight and then the fight tomorrow? Hell yeah, I'm down. I've been trying to get tickets to that, man. It's been sold out. Mm, let Peaches work her jelly. I just may be able to get up seats that's supposed enough for you to feel like you're being hit by Tank himself. Just about a few hours away. Mm -hmm. I know some things we could do for those few hours. Mm. Mm. champion of the world? And my old dad's grandma know who you are. I'm Lucky's brother. Don't play no games with me, bro. Look, man. What the fuck your brother got to do with me? I'm glad you asked. Because I'm trying to find out what you got to do with my brother. Hey, look, man. I got to go, man. I got people waiting on me, man. I ain't got time for this nah, shit, you, man. You good. You good, Duke. You good. Pizza know where you at? She know exactly where you at. Matter of fact, you got enough time for me to tell you a story. Let me tell you about Lucky. Lucky almost lost his life, man. When my mom was giving birth to him, yeah, him or her. I lost my mom in the process. And matter of fact, my little brother was the only thing that I had close to me to remind me of my mom. And when my mom got pregnant, man, I lost my pops too. So we was forced to go live with grandma, you know what I'm saying? She was up in age herself. She did what she could, but she couldn't even feed us, bruh. So you know what I did? I got out here early. I did what I had to do to provide for me and my brother. You know what I'm saying? I did a lot of stuff, murked a lot of people. All in the process, you know what I'm saying? I got out here in these streets real early, man. I started hustling, working my way all the way up. I'm the reason why we got to connect between Little Rock and Louisiana. I done did what I had to do. My little brother watched me work the game, do all kind of stuff, man. In and out, killing, robbing. Going to jail was the best thing could have ever happened to me, bro. That's when I found God. And I tried my best to talk to my little brother Lucky, man. But Lucky had already chose his own path. And you know what's messed up? It's the path that I showed him. I tried to reach my little brother, but it was too late. Because he already chose his path. And I feel like a failure. Life and death. Because I don't know what happened. That's why I'm asking you, Doogie. Who killed my brother? It sound like my nigga Chance. The real is Chance. Chance the nigga that kid. You know what? Man, it don't even matter who Chance is. Like he was a whole ass nigga. And that's the way the game go. You know what I'm saying? If he didn't get murked, then he would have murked somebody else. It's just all in the game, man. So you gonna stand right here and disrespect me, man, after killing my little brother? After taking this watch that's right there on your wrist? Check this out, man. I done said that I had any remorse. I wish I could've killed that bitch before she even had that nigga. 